My name is David Z of David Z Design, and we're going to talk about iris and daisy flower arrangements. What we have is a wooden box here, and. Um, flower foam in there. Basically we watered it, it's ready to go. What we're going to go ahead and do, I chose this time uh, blue irises, more like a purple than blue. Um, it's got the yellow hint of color in it. As you notice by any iris, it's, it comes in uh, two tones basically. Um, you're going to go ahead and grab a bunch of irises, like so. Cut it at an angle and just, just stick it in there, like so. We have this one bouquet, and then we're gonna go ahead and create a second bouquet to give it some more height. Let's pick the irises right here. Just a very simple arrangement. This is a much larger bouquet, so we're gonna go ahead and have this one stick up like this. There you go. So since we have an accent color, which is our yellow, I have some yellow ribbon, which we're gonna go ahead and tie in at the bottom. So now the next step would be just taking our Gerber daisies, putting in like so. I always like the layered look. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna go ahead and have the daisies go on top of each other. We'll create that layered look. like so. You can, if you like, you can only add the daisies to the front of your arrangement, but I like to go all around. So in this case, we're going to be probably using more than a dozen daisies. If you like, you can add some lemon leaves to the bottom of it to fill in the gaps, or just leave it As organic as possible, just the way the daisies come. I like to add the greens. It makes it, it makes it look different. It just makes the flowers pop more. This is the side with the greens. We have the ribbon. I always like to use with silk. I use silk ribbon. It has a beautiful shine. It looks great. And let's do this, and here we go. Just do a knot like this. What you can also do is just add some more ribbon on top of your arrangement. In this case, I would like to use some wired ribbon, like so. We're gonna. Tie it. You can create a bow, do a bow with it, or just leave it hanging loose. I like this ribbon, it's really sheer. It's wired and you can kind of go over this. Let me make sure that the bow looks cool. And you still can see the daisies underneath because we have the sheer ribbon here. And uh, there's one more on the side. Let's keep it a little bit longer. And we're gonna tie this top part. And here we go. We're almost done. And this is how you're going to be able to create an iris and daisy arrangement. Thank you for watching.